Someone forced me to look at a tree and I suspected it was Tilia tomentosa. And I'd probably look for a broad crowned tree, often rather dense foliage, looking very vigorous. The leaves alternately arranged on rather drooping lateral twigs, often the leaves curling up and uh, cupping. Very distinctive feature of this lime is the very strong white underside of the foliage, and you'll notice here, although the leaves are cordate, they're very crinkled and rather thick, too much too thick to be tilia cordata. And yes, look at that! As you pull back the spray, you can see this very white silver underside of the leaves. Very striking feature of this, hence the common name silver lime. And that silverness also carried over into the pubescence on the fruit, <coughs> which is quite distinctly ribbed. And the bark I find also rather distinctive in this lime. It often has rather deep, noticeable fissures developing as it becomes semi mature, with wide spaces in between, which they're smooth and rather silver grey. In the winter, on the twig and alternate buds, there's a very fine silver grey pubescence. And in the winter, I also have still the broad form of the tree. Now look closely at the ends of those lateral branches, and you'll find the tips are drooping down slightly, slightly weeping. Not so much as Tilia petiolaris, which is really a very strongly weeping cultivar, uh, but there's a definite and distinct drooping at the ends.